Welcome to First Word Farmers News Roundup for November the 17th, brought to you today by Senior Editor Matt Dennis. In our top news story, the FDA approved Roche's Hem Libra for patients with Haemophilia A who have developed Factor VIII inhibitors. The agency's Richard Prasdur said the approval provides a new preventative treatment that has been shown to significantly reduce the number of bleeding episodes. However, Hemlibra's label will contain a warning that thrombotic microangiopathy and thromboembolism have been observed in certain patients. The therapy will cost approximately $482,000 during the first year of treatment and about $448,000 the following year. In other news, court filings indicate that AstraZeneca is in talks to settle a Texas lawsuit claiming that it defrauded the state's Medicaid program by marketing Seroquel for unapproved uses. The lawsuit, which seeks $5 billion in civil fines, contends that AstraZeneca's sales force pitched Seroquel to child psychiatrists and as a treatment for non-bipolar depression. And finally... The FDA expanded clearance of Pfizer's Sutent to include the adjuvant treatment of adults at high risk of recurrent renal cell carcinoma following nephrectomy. The approval was based on study data showing that Sutent led to a significant reduction in the risk of a disease-free survival event versus placebo in the adjuvant setting. To read these and other stories in full, visit firstwordpharma.com. Are you able to keep up with all the news and views in the biosimilars market? First Word's Biosimilar Index is the only dedicated biosimilar and non-comparable biologics intelligence tool available. Get ahead of your competition and learn more today. 